HQ TV. Today we're going to be looking at the different types of compression systems in scooting, how they work and why you might need one. In order for your headset to work properly, you need to have your bearings compressed together. Originally, this was done with a lock nut on a threaded fork. But if you've decided to run your scooter using threadless forks, you're going to need to get a compression system. The three most common types of compression used in scooting is your ICS, which uses a star nut and a bolt, your SCS, which is a clamp, and your HIC, which uses a shim, a cap, and a bolt. ICS stands for Internal Compression System. This is where a star nut is driven up the length of the bars and a bolt is then fed through the forks, screwed into the star nut, and then held in place like this. SCS stands for Standard Compression System. It's a compression system built into a quad clamp designed for internally threaded forks. Now the bottom two bolts hold the fork in place while the top two bolts hold the bar. Compression is achieved by sliding the forks in, sending down the little cap on top, and then screwing in a bolt like this. HIC stands for Hidden Internal Compression. This is also used on internally threaded forks. So once your forks have been installed into place, a shim is then slid down over the top, a cap and another bolt is screwed in and held in place like this. Now you've seen the different types of compressions used. Stay tuned on Skater HQ TV and we'll show you how to install each one. Let's go.